This scene will take place inside of an archery store called Archie's Indoor Archery. Off to the right, we can see a woman who has come in for a job interview. We can see that she's brought her curriculum vitae, or CV, along with her ID. Her CV and ID should help you remember that this image is all about CVID. The Archer store is a reference to bows, which should help you remember that this is a B-cell disorder. Now, unfortunately for this interviewee, pretty much everything is going wrong for her. First off, she brought her psycho kids along with her to the interview, and we can see them smashing up the business's decorations. Notice that the business has nicely framed and encased in glass the evolution or progression of bows through the ages. The bow off to the left is very primitive looking, and the bow off to the right is a bit more modern looking. Anyway, the bows are a symbol for B-cell, and this progression of bow development should make you think of B-cell differentiation. The fact that the kids are destroying the glass surrounding the bows should help you think of broken B-cell differentiation. In other words, in this disorder, there is a defect in B-cell differentiation. Another thing that's not going her way is the fact that the receptionist has no idea who she is. We can see her examining the ID and thinking, we didn't ask you to come here for an interview. These question marks and confusion by the receptionist refer to the idea that in this disorder, the cause is unknown in most cases. The last thing that's not going well for her is the fact that she brought her dog along for the interview and he's escaped. She asked her kids to watch the dog for a second, but they got distracted smashing up the store. Now we can see the dog running loose and causing all sorts of problems. Notice that the dog has kicked up some dirt along with some of those distinct infectious looking particles. This idea represents infection. Also, a customer nearby is doing his best not to cough up a lung as all of these particles enter his airway. The cough is here to help you think of upper and lower airway infections, including sinopulmonary infections and bronchiectasis. So putting these ideas together should help you remember that patients with CVID may present with sinopulmonary infections and bronchiectasis.